Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the Butterfly Message. I know I'm late today, but I was resting. I was resting. It was a rainy day. And yeah, I was just resting today. Um, so let's get right into it. And to these butterfly messages, if you are new here, these are the butterfly cards. They have messages that are inspired by the traditional tarot deck. And I go and pull messages and then I clarify with the tarot. If you find anything here, great. If you don't, definitely check your other placement placements. Be mindful that this reading is timeless. So this could be past, present, future energies. Also be mindful that these messages are general. So you may not resonate with anything up here. Okay. Um, yeah. So yeah, I was tired and I decided to just rest a little bit. Um, yeah, there's some type, there's something coming in here. I do feel like we do have like a big blessing happening coming in. Um, something's going to come out of the blue. Also, I have somebody stuck in their low diving thoughts. Divine masculine decided to pop up. So I feel like somebody could be missing a divine masculine from their past or divine masculine can be missing a um, person from their past. You got Hey Stranger and then you got you got Hey Stranger, and then you got When It Rains, It Pours. It's, why did I get, like, somebody is running into a person that they did not want to see? Like, they did not want to see this person. Don't slip, okay? This could get you, don't slip. Don't be out here slipping and looking crazy in these streets, because you might just run up on somebody who you don't want to, <laughs> you don't want to see you like that. So, you know? You know? Um, you're like, Fuck. It's like, and I run into this person of all people at this goddamn time. So this is telling you don't slip, y'all. Some don't don't get caught slipping out here in these streets, okay? Um, something telling me I want to go into my black cards. I do want to go into my black cards today. Yeah, somebody gonna run into somebody, catch them way off guard, and they gonna be looking a mess. A mess. A mess. Um, you got forming new friendships. I hope it ain't that new person that you was trying to know. No, 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 Um, somebody gonna be looking a mess. Somebody not gonna be ready. <laughs> not gonna be ready. You got the um forming new friendships. You got wise one reminiscing somebody's reminiscing you got that this could be a fire sign um somebody is very very wise beyond their years somebody is very very wise somebody made a great investment and i am seeing somebody getting some type of fruits of their labors in the presence of their enemies wow wow Somebody made a good investment. You got I trust you as well. Let me get one more before we get into this. And then somebody's scared and stuck. At the bottom of the deck, you got good news when it comes to love. Somebody may be getting asked out. Why? Because you look so good. Yeah, somebody's definitely, somebody might be getting asked out. You might be, somebody is basically, when the good news comes, when it comes to love, um, this is basically, something's going to make you feel real, real good romantically. So somebody may be asking someone out. You may be finding out that somebody has feelings for you. Somebody may be wanting to deepen a, a, deepen a connection or um, build some type of commitment with you. It's looking good. Why? Because you looking good. Okay. So let's get into this. I'm going to go and so I'm going to use the light sears. And then I think I'm probably going to use the gilded tarot. Right. So let's get into this. Tell me more about missing a lover from my past. Wow. Got the King of Cups. King of Cups is missing on somebody. So that's could be divine masculine missing. It looks like somebody they healed, and as they were healing, they realized, look, all up in the memories, six of cups, missing a lover from the past is 
inspired by the six of cups the six of cups is at the bottom of the deck somebody's also someone's ex if this is you if i'm getting this person's energy and they're missing you you definitely help this person heal and help this person get to some sort of alignment um this person definitely looks at you as the empress look this is what all they missing somebody feel like that they messed up big time when they left you like they messed up big time um, and they want to, they, they wish they could steal another opportunity and it's all like steal another opportunity. Like, it's like, if I knew what I knew now type of energy, they are this person, or this could be your energy. Um, someone definitely is content where they are, but things get a little bored. Things get a little boring here. They get a little bit, you know, unmotivated sometimes and, there's a new cup coming in to, for this person or for someone, okay? If this is your energy, there's a new cup of love coming in. So it's looked like, um, or this person could have realized that they spent so much time worrying about themselves, worrying about their possessions, worrying about them accumulating some type of success, that they, that they weren't worried about love in that moment and they missed out on a great opportunity, okay? They missed out on a beautiful bond with a beautiful person. They're ready to do things new. They could either be, they're ready to do things new. And this has a lot to do with them expressing their feelings. So don't be surprised if somebody shower you with love or shower you with compliments or start blowing your phone up. They just get this thing like, I have to do something. I have to act. Tell me more about Divine Masculine. Then you have the King of Action sitting right there. It looks like Divine Masculine is going into a new phase in, in their life. Okay. Divine Masculine has gotten out of a hard place. Okay. Definitely has gotten out of the hard place. And now, now justice is being served. Now in this new, this new cycle or this new phase, Divine Masculine is happy. There's a Divine Masculine that's very, very happy in this new phase in their life. Um... There's also, I've been also getting that somebody is doing very well when it comes to finances. And this person who's doing very, very well when it comes to finances, they're alone, okay? What else do we have with Divine Masculine's energy? Yep, the, that's him. <laughs> that's him. So, your Divine Masculine is looking for you. A Divine Masculine, you, that's you. Like, you've done your healing. Some of you got you, you've, you're in a better place financially, okay? You've healed, okay? Your mind is not so negative and toxic. It's like it's like you grew up, okay, in a certain type of way, or you've healed. You know, you transition, you trans, you transform your mind. Still missing <laughs> divine masculine. It's like who's missing who? Divine masculine is missing this person. I feel like you know exactly who this person is, or this person is definitely having these, having a lot of dreams about you right now. Tell me more about when I say I'm good. Trust me, I'm good. Yeah, somebody could definitely be faking the funk. Somebody needs a lot of help, but somebody doesn't want the help. It's like, how could you help somebody who don't want to be helped? It's like somebody has a lot, like this person's carrying a lot. You see a person struggling with something, and it's like, well, now I'm good. I got it. I can do it by myself. And it's like, okay, I'm going to let them do it. I feel like um, this could possibly be you. You could possibly be trying to do something all by yourself and not in resisting some type of help. There's some, some assistance coming in that's going to help you with something and let them. It's like be trusting and let them. There's also a, a perfect connection like... You could use the rest. For some of you guys, you could use the rest. Like, you could use this help. Like, you can use this this recharge. You can use the sleep, okay? You can use the sleep now. You can use the day to yourself for some of you guys. It can, and it doesn't have to be like, I don't know what it is. It can be like taking too many, taking too many tasks or trying to do too much or a person is assisting, trying to help you with something that you normally do and you normally get burnt out doing it. But since you're so used to doing it, you're like, oh, no, 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 I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I got it. I got it. I got it. 
when you don't really have it. So it's like when you get this assistance in your life, especially around this time, anybody asking to help you, anybody asking to support you in any way, send you some type of help, some type of assistance. For some of you guys, you've been asking for help. You've been asking for assistance. And this could just be, you know, open your eyes at when you got an assistance, you pushed it away. So some of you guys could also feel unsupported, but then this could be opening your eyes to the fact that when you get support, when you get people trying to support you, you could be pushing the support away and saying like, I'm going to do it myself for whatever reason that you want. So you could, pro you could probably be like, I don't want to burn them with this. This is too much. I, I wouldn't ask them to do this. Whatever reasons you made up, but you're pushing the support away. And that's what, that's what spirit wants you to see. Okay. Cause you can definitely need, you need the rest. Um, tell me more about my light in the dark tunnel. Family. Somebody's family is surrounded around them, like wrapped around them. Um, like somebody's family is everything. I do feel like also this could be divine masculine missing on you or divine masculine missing on somebody. Somebody was just everything. And as much as they try to fake some type of feeling, they couldn't like they they can't fake. Somebody can't fake about how valuable you were in their lives. Like so, some somebody played a huge part in somebody's healing journey. And whether or not you re you rekindle or you've reconciled, this person's energy is very very big around this time. For some of you guys, you may have done something like there could be something that you guys always did around this time or maybe you did something around this it's something about this time or maybe it's just them you know going through their heads but for some of you guys it could be something around this time that is making them miss on you there's something that happened around this time that making them think about you and you're definitely on their minds um somebody is definitely there's some type of conflict as well here There's some type of conflict as well here. I feel like somebody could just be wanting peace. Yeah, somebody could just be wanting peace. Could just be wanting peace with someone. Look, there you got. Tell me more about not giving up without a fight. Somebody's going after their desires. And this could be divine masculine or this could be you. I feel like somebody's not going to be get, not going to give up on their desires on what they're wishing for. Also, um, on finding their happiness on whatever that may be. Somebody may have found their happiness and they're not giving it up. Um, you would definitely gonna have to fight them first before they let you into their peace, uh, which is kind of backwards, but hey, um, it's like you're holding on to it. Like your valuables, somebody is not letting their valuables out so loosely anymore. I do also feel like there is a new beginning and there's going to be a life-changing event um, there could also be a, a, a celebration or something like that, and somebody's holding on to the joy, okay? Um, yeah, somebody is completely happy here. Somebody is completely happy. I do also feel like somebody could have been working really, really hard. Um, definitely enjoying the fruits of their labor. But I do feel like a person has become more peaceful and more one with spirit. Tell me more about all things must be equal. Yeah, somebody's thinking about what they're thinking about. Somebody think about you. Look, you got this dynamic. There's a dynamic duo. Or there is a relationship that has so much energy in it. However it ended. I'm just getting this person's energy all over the reading. Um, somebody is trying to make things make things right. Somebody is trying to make things right. Yeah, what did I say? Temperance coming right out the deck. Somebody's trying to make things right. Somebody wants to heal something. Like, it's uneven. I feel like a person is looking like for all that you brought to their life, for them or for you guys to be this way, the, the, the scales is unbalanced. This is not right. Something's not right. Something's not sitting right. It's not well with... It's, something's not right with them. Somebody's thinking about connections. 
Somebody also connections may... This person is thinking about how... Somebody worked too much. Somebody worked too much or somebody did not spend enough time. And um, they're, they're, they're really thinking about how that could have possibly, you know, made things the way they are. Tell me more about a, an unknown journey. Yeah, that's an unknown journey, all right. Okay, you got the Knight of Wands here. Um... There's an unknown journey coming for somebody, okay? Um, definitely behind the scenes. There could definitely be a little bit of conflict or chaos in this unknown journey. Maybe because it's unknown and it's unexpected. But you do have the justice cards coming right out. I do feel like that there is a connection here. I feel like somebody could be popping into a person. Please don't let it be that person. Who, if this is this person's energy, that remember when I first started at the top of the deck, it's like, wow, when it rains and pours, and then, hey, stranger. Um, this is That, to me, it just makes it seem like you're seeing a person who you definitely do not want to see right now. Like, it's like, and and then I'm running into this person, like, fuck. Like, it's like that. I don't know how you're going to be running into them. Um, but I do feel like this person could be taking you on an unknown, wow, on an unknown journey. <laughs> There's a connection of some sort. Tell me more about, wow, this was out of the blue. Person could be making you, giving you, yeah, somebody could be taking you on some type of travel. Something pops up right out of the blue. Something does cause, cause it's like there's some type of conflict that is on the end of this blessing. Like that's, that's, that's lingering with this blessing. Um, I do feel like somebody could definitely be getting a lot of attention and you know, and somebody could be getting a lot more notoriety and things like that. And you can be getting a little bit negative comments or something like that. Or I do feel like if this is some type of choice or something, some type of relationship or something out of the blue, I do feel like you can go through a moment where you're feeling a little bit conflicted. Tell me more about Spirit Guys Got It Covered Behind the Scenes. Something's telling you just move with the process. Just go for it. Just go for it. It's like, also, don't give in to negative thoughts. There's a new beginning that's bringing some type of love, but definitely you can get trapped and sidetracked by fear. Tell me more about Mama's Boy. There's a mama's boy that's hiding something that's going to get exposed here. There's a mama's boy that's hiding something or this mama's boy could be hidden. Yeah, somebody... Wow, I just blew it. Somebody has a gift. <laughs> Somebody's going to be getting a gift. It's going to be from a mama's boy. Yep, some, some type of lux luxury item. And you're going to be like, whoa, this was a... Okay, it ain't tricking if you got it. Because <laughs> um, Emperor said, well, it ain't tricking if you got it. <laughs> Some type of luxury item, you're going to be like, wow, this is, wow, wow. You know, this is out of the blue. Somebody wants to show how they feel about you. Somebody wants a, a token of... This is a token of their appreciation. Tell me more about teamwork makes the dream work. Teamwork makes the dream work, but it looks like somebody is releasing something. Tell me more about this. Are you releasing the team? Yes, look like somebody... Teamwork makes the dream. It was supposed to make the dream work, but something didn't. 
Um, there was some type of teamwork that was supposed to work. Something was supposed to work, but it did not work. Um, this could be possibly be like some type of some type of uh, this could have something to do with that gift. Okay, something is not going to fly with somebody. Yeah, something's not going to fly with somebody. Tell me more about good shoes. Tell me more about goody two shoes. I said good shoes. Maybe somebody's getting some shoes. Tell me more about goody two shoes. Some some type of gift is not going to fly with somebody. Um, there's a goody two shoes that has a lot coming at them right now, and they're kind of thrown out of balance with all of this coming at them right now. Um, somebody is still kind of heartbroken. Also, this could have something to do with like the past. Um, somebody's feelings or how they felt about somebody is being highlighted right now. It's being pushed to the surface. It's being illuminated. It's being exposed. So somebody could probably feel like off guard or maybe somebody definitely like all these feelings at once, how this person thought you were going to react to it. It's like, no, it's a little bit much. Also, somebody could be communicating the person, communicating or calling the person too much. And that could be throwing somebody off balance. Tell me more about stuck in my low vibe and thoughts. Got the magician stuck in their low vibrant thoughts. You know, there's a magician around here that's stuck in their low vibrant thoughts. And this definitely could be a friend because you do have the four of wands. It's somebody who you can party with, kick it with, talk to, have a good time, see somewhere. Um, it does feel like this person has the opportunity, like will try to manipulate a situation. Um, somebody could definitely have the power to manip manipulate a situation. Yeah, I feel like for somebody is, somebody's energy totally transformed. And this could be because somebody felt like that somebody's, somebody's going to open their heart or try to be, try to get close to you and you're going to push them away. Something is like a major ending, and now this person is seeing out. This person's in their feelings. Yeah, in their feelings. Tell me more about Smile Back. Wow, somebody's leaving. Somebody's leaving. Somebody's going in a totally new direction. Somebody's leaving. Somebody's at a new beginning. It's like... It's turn. It's like giving turn around and smile, instead of like smile back. It's like turn around and like somebody's going smile back as they're turning around to leave somewhere to transition into a new place. So somebody could be going somewhere. This could be like family um, wishing somebody all for somebody just leaving the situation. You got a person that just has their back turned and they're just going to turn around and just smile and keep it moving. Um, yeah. A lot going on, a lot going on. Let's get into these black cards. Where we at? We at 23. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay. All right. Let's see about forming new friendships. Okay. Tell me more about forming new friendships for Libra. Somebody is definitely going to be sent a lot of new friendships. I feel like for some of you guys, these are going to be friendships that are definitely going to be alignment. These are definitely going to be things that you're going to cross paths. That's going to cross paths while you're in alignment, while you are ascending. These are friendships that are built to get you to the next level, okay? Loving relationships. Yeah, you got the lovers too here. Definitely loving relationships. I do also feel like honest relationships, relationships that definitely, you know, represent you, that are a reflection of you. Um, our reflection of your growth, okay? Um, 
definitely are a reflection of your growth and your accomplishments and things like this. Stepping into this new phase of your life, you're going to be put with different pl place. Um, you're going to be matched with different people, and that is strategic for the universe to get you to ascend on your journey. Um, yeah, these are great relationships that you're forming, great friendships. Tell me more about reminiscing. The hermit reminiscing. Somebody's lonely reminiscing about past what? Past what? Past love. An old love. You see this old person in this page of cups? Somebody could be, rem rem be reminiscing about an old love. Like you could be reminiscing about that love that um, <clears throat> it's from years ago. Got the queen of swords to so somebody. <laughs> it could be you. Okay. Um, that's a person, like I said, somebody is really, really thinking about you. Like, you are definitely on this person's mind. Like, definitely on this person's mind. There's a new phase, a new chapter. This new phase in this thing is going to be an unexpected visit or unexpected call. Somebody's going to get an unexpected call from someone who you haven't seen in a while, you haven't heard from in a while. Um, this could also, the hermit do represent the ghost, okay? So this could also be a ghost, a person who stopped talking to you or you stopped talking to. Um, so, yes, they think about you. I'm, I'm going in every, every direction. They think about you. They think about you heavy. Tell me more about wise one. Yeah, wise one is acting now. So somebody, somebody's thoughts has got them to act super fast. Also, I do feel like somebody's wisdom, but this is in inner. And since someone is is remin reminiscing, the wise one, the hermit is the wise one. So it's like somebody's thoughts is having them to act. Like now they have something. Now they need to prove something. Now they need to go do something. I feel like this person could purposely try to cross your path. Somebody could be purposely riding past your house, riding past your favorite restaurants, wherever it is you're supposed to go to. Somebody could be purposely doing that. Um, like I said, I feel like you cross this person's mind. Now they have this new option. Now they feel like that they have to express. They're very, very like they're they're willing to, they're ready to surrender. They're super dedicated. Like all these, they're super dedicated. You cross, you all of a sudden, you cross a person's mind. Now they are super dedicated to connecting with you. With you. Tell me more about fire sign. Someone's missing a fire sign. Somebody's missing the fire sign. You got the devil card at the bottom of the deck with the page of wands here. Um, I do feel like somebody really wants to know if you're free. Somebody really wants to know. Somebody could also be thinking about like the passion between you two. Yeah, with the temperance, the passion between you two, the fire. Um, think about how you look. Tell me more about uh, I trust you. Mm. Yeah, you got a person who definitely trusted somebody. Okay. So this is a whole different energy here. Somebody trusted somebody and they stabbed them right in the back. They stabbed them right in the back. And I keep getting this Aries energy. They stabbed them right in the back. Somebody could be crying over that, crying over what a, a fire sign did to them. Um, and this could ha be something that happened in the past or something could be close to home or something like that. Um, something was also unexpected. It's a real energy of unexpectancy. Um, somebody could have did something behind your back at work, or somebody could be doing something or saying something behind someone's back at work, and you could you could have trusted this person. Tell me more. Wow. The emperor. Did somebody stab somebody? The emperor stabbed somebody in the back. <laughs> 
The emperor could also signify someone's job. Like somebody's in a job. I feel like somebody could be, the emperor could be feeling like that they expressed their feelings or something and they got stabbed in the back with it. Yeah, this also caused, like, with the cause, something happened unexpectedly, either from the emperor, or this could be past energy, like, you trusted this person, they stabbed you in the back, not one, not two, not three, not four, not five, not six, not seven, not eight, not nine, but ten times. Wow, tell me more about great investment in the presence of your enemies. Whoa, great investment, sir. This is multiple bless blessings from, from, from what you've um, these are multiple blessings. Somebody is gaining multiple blessings here. Okay, tell me more. Somebody's gaining multiple blessings. Somebody's about to put the load down. Like somebody's hard work is about to pay off and it's going to pay off tenfold. <clears throat> the sun at the bottom of the deck. Major blessings with the three of pinnacles so something that you've been working on is definitely going to pay off um somebody could have definitely felt slighted in the past but they kept on going yeah i feel like for some of you guys this has something to do with at work like all working working wise somebody felt slighted somebody got stabbed in the back or betrayed at work or something like that and something is definitely going to pay off here somebody lets go of the burden tell me more about in the presence of my enemies Getting their desires. You got the star. A whole new beginning. A whole new life. You got the star in the presence of your enemies. Something could definitely... Somebody is going to see someone in a different light. And now somebody could be a target. It's because you're shining here. Shining all around. Somebody could definitely be a target. Or some type of illumination. Or a lot of attention or popularity. Or something like that. Um, it looks like a lot of eyes are going to be on you. There's definitely going to be a whole lot of support. But there's, like I said, it's like some lingering um, conflict or chaos surrounding this. Tell me more about scared and stuck. There's somebody who's scared and stuck because something that they were working on didn't quite work out or they have... They failed to plan something. Um, and they're stuck. The reason why a person is stuck because their failure to plan something. Um, somebody could be wanting to plan to make some type of, to have some kids. Somebody could be planning to have kids at the bottom of the deck. They will have that, but definitely planning. Somebody's trying to plan to build a family or something with the empress. They will have this, but they do have to um, plan first. Somebody could also be wanting to, yeah, somebody is wanting to, you know. Somebody feels like they, they, they probably would never get it since they didn't make something right. Somebody's really missing somebody here. Yes, okay. So that's the message that I have for you guys today. I hope this reading resonated with you. If it did, make sure you give this reading a big thumbs up and make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel. I love you guys and I will see you in the next video.